Hello everyone and welcome to my vitamin D walk talk. Well, I'm not quite walking today, and but I am getting vitamin D. I'm getting about 64 IUs a minute right now on my skin. It feels great out here. I think it's about 78 degrees. It is amazing. I'm sitting at this beautiful park uh, on my lunch break, but I am not walking today and here is why. So yesterday I was on um, a couple hours of vegan business training and one of these trainings that I watched was all about creating content and how to create like 100 days worth of content really, really quickly. Two giant things that I learned is that for YouTube videos, I need to turn the camera horizontally and also not have it be so jumpy. It needs to be pretty stable. So me holding it right now is a little bit more stable than it walking. So I, I'm gonna try it, uh, why not? Love learning new tips, love learning new things to improve my videos and make them better for you guys. So here's to change and new things. But I wanted to pop on here today and talk about my juice fast. I am on day one right now of my juice fast. And I am a detoxification specialist through Dr. Robert Morse. Dr. Robert Morse always talks about fasting and fasting to heal and doing these cleanses and this. And I've never done a juice fast, like honestly. Never, ever, ever done a juice fast. And that's not to say that I don't drink all liquids because there are days that I will drink 100% liquid. But I like the fiber in the fruit and I like the fiber in the vegetables. So I blend my things. I blend my watermelon, I blend my pineapples, I blend my smoothies. I don't juice these things. I rarely ever just drink fruit juices. Um, so I wanted to do this. I had three reasons I wanted to jump into a juice fast and I'm going to tell you guys kind of why I really want to do this because I believe there's a time and a place for fasting. It's not something, I mean, yes, you can lose weight in here and there, but there is some power, like some very, very, very much powerful benefits behind fasting that you can kind of capitalize on if you need to do it. So the biggest thing that I'm going to be working on is I, um, had Oh, that's not gonna work with my hand. Man, this is gonna hurt my arm holding this up for a while. I need to bring my tripod. That's another thing I'm gonna probably do. But I did, um, okay, so number one thing I really wanna take away, one of my goals over this fast that I'm doing, it's gonna be either three to five days, we'll see. Like I bought a bunch of uh, vegetables and fruits and I wanna be able to get through all of them. I don't wanna waste my food. So I'm gonna try to make all the juices that I planned and I planned about 28 juices. So it's a lot. I might have planned a little too much because I'm a crazy planner, but you know, that was all part of it. But the number one goal of this fast is to heal my wrist inflammation. Um, a couple weeks ago, I started getting pain in my wrist and it was kind of weird because I don't normally get pain in my wrist. So I want to break up the acids. I want to kind of flush out my system. I want to alkalize my system and I want to break down that pain. Um, doing fasting is a great way to kind of reset and regenerate your body. And this is what it's going to do for me. It's going to be fantastic. Um, my second goal of this fast is basically just to do it. I mean, I've literally never done a juice fast, so I want to prove to myself, hey, yeah, like I can do this. Um, I can do this. I have energy on this. I feel fantastic on this, you know, and it's, it is what it is. So, um, number two, and then number three is, is more for me to document it. Um, when I juice, cause I've had a juicer now for about a year and a half and I bought a juicer so I could not let my produce go to waste. Um, and for me, it's like when I have produce is going bad, I can juice it. And if I'm not going to eat it, cause I typically like to eat my food. I really enjoy eating the fiber. I don't use the juicer as much. Um, and then you get all that pulp too. And it's like, I don't know what to do with pulp. I guess I make crackers and this and that. So I just don't juice as much as I thought I would. Um, I do like having the juicer. Um, I do believe you could have, you can juice without having a juicer. You just do it with your blender, but you have to press it through a nut milk bag and that kind of definitely wouldn't be good for my wrist right now. So, I mean, you can do that. And I did that for years before I actually paid money for a juicer. I actually got, spent some money on my juicer, but, um, so yeah, it took a long time. I, um, I planned to do about 10 different recipes. Um, my goal in this juice was to always have a green in with the fruit. So I'm not just getting that pure, pure sugar. It's not going to mess with my blood sugar levels. I'm going to get that green to kind of stabilize it a little bit and to mix it up and have it different. So I made about five of the recipes yesterday. It took me a long time. Like I want to say two and a half hours or three hours or so. Um, I was kind of in and out doing it and taking breaks because it was just a lot, but I had to like juice it, clean all the vegetables, chop all the vegetables really small because my juicer, I have to chop them small. And then I had to put them, feed them through slowly. And then I had to clean my juicer out every single time after. So I kind of wasn't transferring any of the color or any of the nutrients over. So it was a process. It took a long time, but it also allowed me to wake up like 20 minutes later this day. So I got to sleep in just a little bit later today. So it was kind of nice. And tonight I don't have really anything to do other than do some more stuff. So I guess it will take me time tonight, but it'll probably take me not time. Like, you know, like right now I won't be eating, I won't be doing stuff like, and really at night, like I'm not gonna have to cook. I'm not gonna have to do a lot of the stuff. So it's gonna save me some time. It's gonna be great. But yeah, 
I don't know. I'm curious to see the benefits. Um, I might go longer. I might go shorter. Like who knows? Like my goal is three days. I will. I will hit three days no matter what because I do have this juice and I'm not gonna let this juice go, go to waste. I want to do this. I'm when I set my mind to a goal, I do it, and this is no no exception. I'm gonna do this as well. So I will definitely update you guys on my journey. Um, I'll probably do like a recap video, maybe a mid video. I don't really know. Like I might be feeling freaking amazing and having all this energy and feeling incredible and just talk about it because I truly believe that juice can help help you. But I believe there's a time and a place for it. <laughs> so um, I hope you guys have a great day. I am going to get back to the office because I have a lot of work today. This is about 320 ounces of juice that I juiced on Sunday night. This is about half of what I will be doing.